Okay, so a quick little observation on this Kadota fig, because I've only got a couple minutes of memory here, so this will be quick. <clears throat> so this Kadota fig, I got this one yesterday at Lowe's, and the reason I picked this one out was because it had so many figs on it already being such a small tree. And when you pick them like that, you know they're going to be highly productive, okay? But I was looking at the leaves on these as compared to the leaves of all the other figs that I have around here. And it seems that this leaf uh, type in particular is extremely tough. I mean, this feels like exactly like leather. And it's kind of scratchy. And I know that all the other figs are kind of scratchy too, but they're a little bit smoother. Whereas I noticed on this Kadota, I mean, these are just tough. And if you turn them over, you see all these veins, right? And then the other figs, not so much of that structure. See that there? It's more like an open weave, and this is super tight. So I think that's why this one does so well here is because it has that super tough leaf. Now, if we go look at this other one around here on the spellier wall, let me get around here real quick. This one has the same leaves. It didn't change between being from a California leaf to being an Arizona leaf, which a lot of the plants do do, okay? Well, this one, these ones don't. And also, this thing is still producing. I don't know if you can see them up there. Up there maybe a little bit better. It's still full of figs. So this thing has been continually producing since March. So March, April, May, June, July, August, all, all of August probably, September. What is that, seven months-ish? So I mean, talk about a productive tree. I mean, I've been eating, I'm pretty much sick of figs. So I'm probably not even gonna eat any more of these. The birds will probably get them. So, yeah, so I really like this, this fig tree. All right, guys, thanks for watching.